Sodor, Duck and Oliver are resting in the shed. Duck was being fired up for a passenger train when... Hey, Duck. Yes, Oliver? Can I take your passenger train today? Sorry, Oliver. I've already been scheduled to do it. I've already been scheduled. Oh. Oliver's heart sank. Because that means he was stuck doing odd jobs. And he did not like that at all. But before Duck could leave, Sir Top of Hat walked up. Boop, 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 boop. Hello, you two. Hello, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning to you two, you two. So, I'm going to be blasting around your line for the next couple of weeks while cor quarry workers are. So, Duck, instead of pulling your passenger train today, that shall be cancelled and you should go to work on Thomas's branch line. Oliver, you shall go to work on Edward's branch line. Does that make myself clear? Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Excellent. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a package of donuts waiting for me. Boop, boop. And he walked away. Yes, I get to go work on Edward's branch line. I'm sure he'll let me do some of actual work. Actual work? What's that supposed to mean? I mean, like, not really odd jobs, like you do. You won't make me do the odd jobs every day. What are you talking about? Yesterday I made you pull that passenger. No, I stole it. Well, see you later then, Oliver. I earned that too now. Oops, sorry. I've got work to do, said Duck. And he puffed away. Yes, more, more work on Edward's branch line for me. Oliver puffed up to Edward's branch line. Oh, hello, Edward. Will I take that passenger train of yours? Sorry, Oliver. I've already been I've already been scheduled to take it. And my guard's just about to blow the whistle. You can shunt around the yard if you like. Okay then. I guess I'll do that until you return. Then can I pull a passenger train or something? There's a small goods going up to Vickerstown. You can do that. Okay, said Oliver. Once again, Oliver's heart sank. But he went off to the yard. Oliver was still a little disappointed. Pointed, but feeling a little bit better when he arrived at Vickers Town. That was a nice long run. I thought Edward Brown's on the least next step to the dock. So, I guess it must have been long for Edward Brown to do the Vickers Town. Not through the Vickers Town. Oh well, better get back to the yard. Maybe he'll let me pull his passenger train. Oliver was, Oliver was just returning when Edward arrived. Hello, Edward. Now, can I take your next passenger train? Edward thought about it for a moment. He really enjoyed pulling passengers, as usually he's stuck in the yard shunted for other engines, for their trains. But then, he saw how sad Oliver looked. He must have Edward thought that Oliver didn't get to do stuff like this on his branch line. So, Edward thought for another quick moment, and said, Yes, of course you can, Oliver. Absolutely. Thank you, Well, I'll go get ready for my next passenger train right away. I did the right thing. Oliver was preparing to leave. Don't shut the coaches too hard, said Edward, and watch out for the signals. Sometimes there's a sticky one between here and the main line. Okay? Right out, Edward. I'll, I'll be sure to be careful of those. Oh, there's also a bumpy part of my line. Make sure that you don't go over it too fast. The passengers will complain more than usual. Got it. The guard blew his whistle and Oliver puffed away. Oliver loved it. He got to pull passenger and go fast along the line. But what he didn't know was Gordon was coming fast. Express coming through! He called. But Oliver didn't hear him. He was having too much fun. Gordon had switched on to the other line to let Ed Oliver pass. But Oliver was coming on that line. He stopped, thinking it was safe. But Gordon came rushing in. Whoa! 
Ouch. Got kind of hurt. Indeed. Edward brought the breakdown train. Good gracious, Oliver, are you okay? Yes. What about you, Gordon? Just fine. You can't damage a big, strong engine like me that easily. Then, Sir Topham Hart walked up. Oliver, please explain what's going on here. Well, sir, I was puffing up the branch line. Gordon switched on to the wrong line. He was trying to let me through, but we accidentally collided. I see. Well, in that case... Since no one was hurt, and everybody is safe, and Oliver, really, you did a great job with those coaches I hear. The passengers were telling me all about it, until you, until, of course, the collision. Sorry, sir. It won't happen again, sir. No worries. So, in that case, we will send you and Gordon to the works, and then you can get back into the service on your branch line with Duck. Oh, Duck, how I missed him so much, though. Don't you two have a little... No, Gordon, no. We're just friends, that's all. Oliver returned from the works to find Duck there. Duck! Oliver! How was it working on the branch line with Edward? It was fine. I got to pull a passenger train. Oh, I only, I wish, only I wish I could do that and pull my own coaches, like Thomas does. Well, you had a crash out here. Yes, yes I did, with Gordon. And you weren't very badly damaged, I also hear. Can you stop saying I hear? But yes, yes I did. And yes, no I wasn't very badly damaged. Well, if only we could have our own coaches, you know, besides Dexter. Who's Dexter again? My coach, don't you remember? I saved him from scrap pretty much. Oh, right. Well, I wish I could have my own coaches. But... That'll have to wait for another time.